Hey, 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 Med School Made Easy with another clinically relevant mnemonic. This is when we're talking about soft tissue sarcoma. Uh, soft tissue sarcoma represents, or sarcoma represents about 1% of all adult malignancies. Um, one thing about sarcomas is that they classically don't have lymph node involvement. They don't spread to your lymph nodes like other malignancies will, with the exception classically of five different uh, histopathologic subtypes, and that's where this mnemonic comes in. Um, I put this period here, we'll talk about in a second why the first one might not be a part of this mnemonic much longer. Uh, but in any case, those five types scare, right? So synovial, clear cell, angio, rhabdomyo, and epithelial. And why is this clinically relevant, besides trying to get a pin question right, is that with these five subtypes, you classically would give them adjuvant, okay? So you cut off, you know, you resect the tumor, you cut off their leg, you go in the retroperitoneum, whatever. You get the sarcoma out, you get an, an R0 resection, and the question is adjuvant or no adjuvant um, in terms of like chemotherapy and things like that. If you had one of these and you had evidence of lymph node involvement or a really nasty tumor or, you know, uh, not favorable differentiation or something, you'd want to add on some sort of adjuvant therapy. Um, the reason why I put this period here is because a recent article looked at uh, these five types to kind of validate this mnemonic. And they actually found that synovial um, had significantly less lymph involvement than the other four. So they even recommended using just care as the mnemonic and getting rid of the S. Uh, but in any case, classically, it's scare uh, for those five, synovial, clear cell, angio, rhabdomyo, and epithelial sarcoma. All right, thanks.